Hey, welcome to my video and today is going to be a top 5 Game Boy games. I still have mine from when I was younger. I think I had mine when I was 6 or 7. I'm not sure but I still play it and I still have a bunch of games and I'm gonna tell you which ones I think are best. On number 5 is a game from the Looney Tunes actually. It's called Danger on Mars. It's in Dutch so I think that's the right name of the game, I'm not sure, but it looks like this. So this game from the Looney Tunes I actually got after I got Pokemon. And whenever I didn't feel like playing Pokemon anymore because I had to train too much or whatever, I would just take a break and play that Looney Tunes game and it was actually pretty good. And number four goes to Game and Watch Gallery 3. Um, I also had this when I was very young and it's a pretty cool game. It's um, with Yoshi and the Mario Brothers and everything and Donkey Kong as well. And um, it's pretty fun. It's all of those mini games that you can play and you can just let other people play it and then you can see how high your ranking is and all that stuff so um, yeah I really enjoyed this game I actually bought this game secondhand not too long ago because I I had it before but I kind of lost it I don't know how but um, maybe if I'll find it back then I have two copies which I don't mind because it's a pretty good game Number 3 goes to Super Mario and this one is Super Mario Land. It's one of my favorite games from Super Mario. I really love it. Me and my grandma used to play it all the time. She actually had a... well she still has um, a NES at home and I used to play Super Mario on that all the time and then I got my Game Boy so I wanted a Super Mario game as well. So then I started playing this one and this was actually my first Mario game I ever owned. And it's pretty good and it's not that easy which was good for me it was a challenge so um, yeah I've put quite a few hours in this game but it's totally worth it and number two guess who Zelda of course um, this was my first Zelda game ever as well. Um, I remember I had Oracle of Seasons and my brother had the other one and we just love to play it both and um, but I do prefer uh, Oracle of Seasons to be fair. I really recommend you buying this one. I know you can buy that one on the Nintendo store now I think for the DS so if you can do that um, you, should, you totally should. I don't even think it's that much money. And number one is of course Pokemon and I still have four games. Um, I have blue, gold, yellow and crystal. I do have one favorite but I'm not going to tell you because I'll be making a top 5 Pokemon video so you'll have to watch that if you want to know which one is my favorite. And it's not only gonna be the Game Boy games, it's also gonna be the DS games. I just love every single game they put out till now. And like, okay I will tell you one thing. In between gold and crystal I prefer gold and if I have to choose between blue and yellow, I think blue because yellow is, I'm not going to say it's too easy, but you can have all starters plus Pikachu in yellow, so that kind of makes it easy, I guess. So, um, yeah, blue, definitely. I'm sorry, I'm not for Charizard, I'm obviously Blastoise, always. What? Even in the X and Y, I also chose Blastoise, so... <laughs> This is the end of the video. I hope you liked it. Um, if you want me to do more videos like this, like top videos of games, um, I could do Pokemon, Zelda, DS, 
Wii, all of that stuff. Um, it's mostly gonna be Nintendo. So if you want me to do that, you can pop a comment below and tell me what you thought about the video as well. And I would like to know what your favorite Game Boy games are and it's probably lots of nostalgia for everyone. So um, yeah, I want to see your comments. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. And thank you for watching. Bye.